Hello? Uh-huh. Oh, you said you want me to film a 2024 shoe collection. Okay, I got you. I'll start doing it right now. All right, bye. Man, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy, d -Mag, and I'm back with another banger, you feel me? You nigga been coppin' out this smoke, we done passed that I'm tired of that hoe, wanna hear her friend because I had Say my bro, told him I'm crack, I don't know why he did Wish I would rock that on that drill, I ain't see my dog in a minute You gotta ask this bitch to block, you know that we Hey, and as y'all can tell by the title and the thumbnail, man I am gonna show y'all my 2024 shoe collection Yes, man And before I even get to showing y'all the shoes, man My bad, this is like a, like a touchy subject for me Like... <sighs> Bro, it's on a budget, man. My shoe collection's on a budget, man. I don't got no six thousand dollars, five thousand dollars to go be spending on shoes, man. I gotta pay for rent, man. You feel me? <laughs> Just give me a second. But with all that being said, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you get notified every time I upload. And yeah, with all that being said, let's get into this video. Yes, sir. Y'all can see me good? Man, as y'all can see behind me, man, I got all my shoes. I gathered up all my shoes, man. I'm, I'm missing like a few pairs. Like they probably at my mom's house or something. But yeah, these are all my shoes that I have on me right now. You feel me? So with all that being said, man, Let's get into this video, man. I hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. Because although I know I don't got the best shoes, I know I don't got the most expensive shoes, man. I got some nice shoes, you feel me? But yeah, let's get into this video. The first shoe I want to show y'all that I recently just got is the uh, Jordan 1's, what are these, Into the Spider-Verse? You feel me? And I ain't going to hold y'all. When I first saw them, I was like, okay, they cool. They cooling, all right? But then, like, I was scrolling on StockX, and I was like, I was like, yo. I was like, they actually got some, some style to them, you feel me? Like, they're different. They're not like all the other ones. So I was like, yo, I, I know you want to cop these. So when I StockX bought them, I bought them for a whopping $320. We're going to add it to the mount somewhere. I'm going to put a mount somewhere and show you how much I spent on my shoes. So boom, three hundred twenty dollars because I know stock has to be taxing, bro. That's the only reason, bro. They were like two eighty something, but yeah, I ain't gonna hold y'all. The next shoe I got is the Jordan Five Oreos, man. I ain't gonna hold y'all. I got these like a year ago, and they've been through some stuff. If I'm gonna be wearing a black fit. This is what I'm putting on, bro. On, bro. This is like a cool all around shoe, man. And to be honest, I don't know how much I paid for them, but. Bro, Jordan 5 Oreos, probably around 200 bucks. So let's add that. Yes, sir. Boom. The next shoe I have in my collection is the Jordan 5 What Does. I think that's what it's called. Is that what they're called? The What Does? Let me know if that's what they're called, man. I got these and I was like, what are they? But then I was like, hold on, wait a minute. These low key kind of tough. Bro, I just love like the all around the color to it, man. It got multiple different colors. Look, like, pink on the inside, green, lime green, red, yellow, blue. Man, these are like really not an all around shoes, but if you could put it on, bro, if you know how to put this on, bro, I ain't gonna lie. You got you some right here. You got you some. Probably the same as the Oreos, man. We'll put another 200 on the pole. Yes, sir. Boom. The next ones we got is Jordan 3's. What are these, court purples? You feel me? And I'm not gonna lie, these are my second favorite shoes in, out of all my shoes, man. If y'all don't know, bro, purple is my favorite color, y'all. Favorite color out of every color in the world, man. Purple is the color, the way to go. But I ain't gonna lie, I started getting into Jordan 3's about like, I don't know, like a couple, couple months ago, man. And like, bro, I ain't gonna lie, they is hard, bro. Jordan 3's are tough, but yeah, I got this as a, as a birthday gift from someone, shout out, you know who you are. Hey, but yeah, I ain't gonna lie, this is my second pair of shoes. Now, now we're gonna get into my favorite, favorite shoes that I've been wanting for like, since I was a little jit, since I was a jit, man, I've been wanting these, and when I got them, bro, I was so happy, man. 
and then I got a story behind. You feel me? The next shoe, man, my favorite shoe, man, out of all, man, I've been winning these. And when I finally got them, I was so happy, man. The Jordan 11 Legend Blues, y'all. And I'm not gonna lie, bro, I might need a new pair, bro. Bro, I might need a new pair, bro. Let me tell y'all the story behind these, man. I had these for a good, I had these for a couple months. Um, my mom wanted to know if I wanted to go to the baby concert. I was like, oh yeah, let's go. Me, I'm thinking the concert inside, bro. It was outside on a December rainy night. It was rainy everywhere. The first half of half of the concert, I was walking like this. Y'all know how y'all walk when y'all ain't trying to get y'all shoes dirty. That's how I was walking. Then I was in like the front of the stage, man. People started stepping on my shoes, man. Got all muddy. The bottom of my shoes, mud. Couldn't even see the white no more. It was all brown. And me, I'm not no expert at cleaning those shoes, man. So this is the best I could get it, man. But I feel like I just need a new, fresh pair to restart, man. I'm probably just not even going to wear them. Because these is literally my favorite shoes, y'all. But yeah. Jordan 11 Legend Blues. I need the low tops. I'm not going to hold y'all. I ain't going to hold y'all. I done beat these up. And I don't know what they are. The Concord Breads, I think. I think that's what they are. Jordan 11 Low Top Concord Breads. I had these for like two years, man. And I just felt like I needed some shoes to run around with. And yeah, these were the shoes to run. And now they're all muddy, they're all dirty, they're all everything. These are like my play shoes. The Jordans on bro. Boom. Some Jordan ones, bro. Patent leather. Bro, I don't know what they're specifically called, bro. But I ain't gonna lie. I got these from my aunt. She gave me them. And like, I just feel like these I only wear occasionally. It's cause like it's hard to find an outfit for these and like I just don't have no like gold cover colored clothes. And before I even started um actually trying to find some clothes, I ain't gonna lie, you know them gold Adidas pants that everybody be having, them gold and black ones, them black and gold ones? I was rocking them with these bro, crossman, on um, bro. Jordan one, patent leather, gold and black I guess. But yeah. Those are all my Jordans that I got for y'all. Now we're gonna get into like Nikes, Adidas, and all of things of that nature. So yeah, let's get into this. Boom. These, bought these because I realized I went to work in slides and I didn't have time to go home and I needed shoes to go to work. So I bought these, boom. Went to my little brother's football game. Started raining really bad. The rain started bouncing on my shoes. The rain started hitting the ground, bouncing on my shoes, and mud got all over them. So, they're a little bit dirty. I don't know if y'all could tell, but they're a little bit dirty. But they pretty white. I ain't gonna hold y'all. They still suck. So, yeah. The next one, man. These SB Dunk Lows. Oh, why so sad, bro? I was at work one day, and on my lunch break, not, I didn't even have a lunch, actually. On my 10-minute break, I was like, let me go check out some shoes, man. So, I came in. Was looking for the Bart Simpson. They had them. They didn't have them my size. They only size nine. Then I saw these. And I was like, okay, they're pretty nice. So I was like, why not cop them? You feel me? Why not? You feel me? Three hundred dollars, right? Here. All right, bro. Let me know what y'all think about these, bro. Like, cause I have people saying they're ugly, but like these are actually nice to me. I don't know like why people say they're ugly, but I got New Balances 2002R. You feel me? brown it's got that creamish color y'all know that chocolate where you bite into it and that is that color yeah type b but these are hard man and they're comfortable bro they tough i ain't gonna hold you I, i'm gonna be honest with you i don't know how much they are i'm gonna look it up later but yeah boom and you know a 2023 moving on to 2024 must have like in order to to even have shoe game you gotta have these you feel me Bro, the Panda Dunks, bro. Everybody knows 110. They're just all around shoes, you feel me? But yeah, these is hard. Wear these a couple times. Last one, another must have is some Air Force Ones, you feel me? I ain't gonna lie, they getting a little, little brown. And you know, you don't want them white girl Air Force Ones, bro. Oh, bro, stop wearing them Air Force Ones, bro. If they're beat up, stop wearing them. Oh, bro, like, there ain't no need to wear them, bro. Like, but yeah, you feel me? Must haves. Everybody knows. Get a little brown. Might have to cop me a new pair. But yeah, ninety dollars, one ten. Boom. First pair of Adidas. NMDs, man. Like probably all the Adidas I have are NMDs, man. But these, my dad got them for me with the whole set. You feel me? 
I wear these every now and then, every now and then. But yeah, these are pretty tough. You feel me? They just a casual shoe. You feel me? Can't go wrong. Boom. Got some real, real beat up human races. I ain't gonna hold y'all. Had these for a couple years, man. Might have to take these to the shoe doctor. You feel me? I had these for a couple years, man. It's terrible, man. I try to keep these as clean as possible. But when I tell you, bro, people don't know how to walk, bro. I just gave up. Like, bro, they kept stepping on my shoes. And like these ones, I knew if you get a mark, bro, and you try to clean it, bro, it turns greenish, bro, on, bro. But they kept stepping on my shoes, bro. So at one point, I just gave up and turned these into play shoes, man. So yeah. Boom, some more NMDs, you feel me? My dad also got me these, I believe. I don't really know, actually. But yeah. Oh! I just... Oh my god, I just broke my stuff. That's crazy. But boom, now we got some better lighting in here. My fault, y'all. But boom. So, NMDs, you feel me? They a little bit dirty, bro. Same with these, bro. People don't know how to walk, bro. Like, it's like every time I wear Adidas, bro, they don't know how to walk, bro. And they step on my shoes in. Just like at a certain amount of times, bro, I just give up at that point, bro. I just give up and say, bro, y'all got it, bro. And I just, you feel me? But I had these for a couple, I had these for like two years, too. All right, now, that was all the Adidas I have. And I got rid of most of my shoes, man. I had to, I got rid of them. I gave them to my little cousin. You feel me? Um, but now we're gonna go into my Uggs, you feel me? I ain't gonna hold y'all. Uggs is probably like the most comfiest shoe ever, bro. And I ain't gonna lie, they low-key tough, bro. Y'all might say they gay, bro, because I swear y'all be saying they gay, bro, but they tough, bro. Y'all just gay. You feel me? Bo boom. You know, can't go wrong with the regular brown Uggs. I ain't gonna lie, they kind of lost color because they got rained on so much times, bro. And I only go, I only wear these when I'm on a road trip or something. But these low-key tough, y'all. These low-key tough. And they don't cost a lot. They don't cost a bag. So, next ones, boom. Can't go wrong with the red ones, y'all. Had these for a quick minute too, man. Got rained on and everything. I only wear these when I travel. Or like when I'm going on an airplane or something. These tough, you feel me? Some slight, not too crazy. Yeah. Are y'all ready for my last and final shoe in my shoe collection? I ain't gonna hold y'all. I don't think y'all ready. Man, before I even show y'all, bro, hit that like button for me, y'all. Hit that like button if y'all wanna see this. And make sure y'all subscribe, man. Road to 100. Bro, we at like 93 right now. Did y'all subscribe? All right, I think y'all subscribe. All right, ready? Y'all can see by the box. Yeah, that MCM, yes sir. Man, I got these for Christmas, I think. I wear these when I gotta go party, you feel me? When I gotta, when I gotta put on some, a nice little suit when I, when I gotta put it on, you feel me? Hey, they might look like bricks and Legos, but they tough, bro. Y'all gotta realize it's designer, you gotta be crazy. Bro, tell me how y'all messing with these, man. Let me know how y'all messing with these, bro. Y'all messing with these or not? Yeah, yeah. These ran up a quite little bag, you feel me? These probably like $400. I think that's what the receipt said, 400 Around there. But yeah, y'all, that is, this is my 2024 shoe collection, man. I hope I can get back to y'all at the end of 2024 and show y'all the updated shoe collection, hopefully. Man, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I hope y'all saw the shoes and y'all like the shoes I got, man. I know it ain't crazy, it's crazy. As I said in the beginning, man, it's on a budget, man. I don't got that type of money yet. You feel me? You feel me? YouTube not even paying me, bro. Look, y'all gotta subscribe for them to start paying me. You feel me? And then I bring y'all bangers, man. But I really want to get into doing more YouTube videos and more doing some crazy stuff, man. And some challenges, bro, and pranks for y'all, man. But y'all just gotta like. Comment and subscribe for me, man. That's all I'm asking, bro. And I promise you, I'm gonna bring y'all the craziest bitch ever, man. The toughest bitch, man. But with all that being said, it's your boy D-Mac, and I'm out. Yes, sir. <laughs>